The Soybean School on realagriculture.com is brought to you by Pride Seeds, Nodulator Pro, and Cruiser Max Vibrance Beans. When it comes to variety testing, we often think about yield as being one of the most important aspects or, or factors that we look at. And we all know about performance trials for yield and that, but we also run disease trials as well, looking at our disease screening. And this is a great example here, whether it's corn, soybeans, and wheat, we want to evaluate what for what the varieties or hybrids perform under different disease pressures. Here's a great example of our sudden death syndrome nursery that we have out in the Rodney Westlorn area. Uh, we've got four lines here that you can see. You can see this nice, tall, beautiful green, no symptoms, no yellowing, no spotting on these two. And then these two here are showing um, early SDS symptoms, pretty uniform. We've got six different uh, reps of the, these two particular lines and they're all showing the same thing. We're starting to see tip typical sun death syndrome symptoms here starting from the bottom working their way up the plant here and then as you go farther you can start seeing them starting to show up the uh, up, up the plant as well those symptoms and so it's important to get a good understanding of what these varieties do some of these varieties um, like this one performed very well when it was tested in other areas such as Iowa Missouri etc but here in Ontario under Ontario disease pressure you can see see that it's different. The rating's not the same. So one, you know, there's my plug for local uh, ratings uh, screening as well because populations are different depending on where you are in North America and that. And so you can see um, differences uh, from a local um, perspective as well. So when you're planning for next year, not only go for yield, but also take a look at those disease ratings. Try to gear it towards your field. If you got SDS, SCN, Northern Corn Leaf Blight and that, really really take a look at those ratings and try to pick the best hybrid or variety for your fields you're, you're going to love it it's going to help you maintain uh, both yield and get the best bang for your buck in 2018.